Today we're talking about two electrostatic dissipative materials, ABS ESD7 and Antero 840CNO3. ABS ESD7 is available on the Stratasys F370 and Fortis machines. It combines the strength and durability of ABS with carbon to provide electrostatic dissipative properties. It's great for prototypes, concept models, jigs and fixtures, and support tooling used in static sensitive applications. ABS ESD7 has an ultimate tensile strength of 35 megapascals, an elongation at break of 2 to 3 percent, and a surface resistivity of 10 to the 4th to 10 to the 9th ohms. It's compatible with QSR soluble support. The other ESD safe material available on the Stratasys FDM printers is Antero 840CNO3. Antero 840CNO3 is a high performance PEC based thermoplastic with ESD properties. It's available on the Stratasys Fortis 450 and F900. It uses a breakaway support system called SUP 8000B. It has an ultimate tensile strength of 95 megapascals, a volume resistivity of 10 to the 4th to 10 to the 9th ohm centimeters, and it's very resistant to both heat and chemicals. Applications for Antero include prototypes, ESD safe jigs and fixtures for testing and assembly, and low volume end use parts with strict requirements. With Antero, you can produce highly customized low volume parts with consistent static dissipative properties, high chemical resistance, and ultra low outgassing. This makes it great for industries such as aerospace and automotive. Electronics housings are a great example of parts you'd want to be ESD safe. So I printed this Raspberry Pi housing on the F370 using ABS ESD7. If you'd like to learn more about ESD safe materials, connect with us on our website at cadimensions.com. Thanks for watching.